Good evening, and welcome to another season of Movie Drome. Tonight's film, Assault on Precinct 13, is the second film directed by John Carpenter. It has a tremendous cult reputation, as does his first film, Dark Star, which he co-wrote and co-directed with Dan O'Banion. Dark Star was a science fiction comedy about surfers in space. Its subplot, about a large ball-shaped alien with webbed feet loose aboard the spaceship, became the basic structure of Alien, which O'Banion also wrote. In Assault on Precinct 13, Carpenter goes it alone. Well, not alone exactly. The film is a complicated series of borrowings from other films, in particular Rio Bravo and the most inspirational of all cult movies, Night of the Living Dead. Carpenter also borrows lines of dialogue from Once Upon a Time in the West. In this sense, the film is a cultist's dream. Charles Bronson said that line to Henry Fonda. That's what Angie Dickinson told John Wayne. Some of the lines that Carpenter made of himself aren't bad either. In particular, why would anyone shoot at a police station? But overall, the tone is real pastiche. Carpenter also wrote the music, which is excellent, and did the editing under the pseudonym of John T. Chance. No prizes for guessing which John Wayne film that name came from. Now that we've established its cultural pedigree, perhaps I can join the loyal opposition and say that Assault on Precinct 13 has the odd flaw. There are only two women in the film, and they both wear identical sweaters. They have identical shapes, too. Basically, it's another gun fetishist shoot 'em up a sort of a cut-price Terminator, which we'll also see later in this season. It's big on action, but sort of low on wit. If you compare it to The Honeymoon Killers, which is also part of this year's movie drone collection, Honeymoon Killers has no guns at all and almost no on-screen violence, but it's genuinely frightening and well-acted, too. Ditto for Dead of Night, which we shall also see. If you're interested in learning more about this film, the other films we're going to show, or the ones we showed last year or the year before, you can acquire for a very modest fee a Movie Drone book, which also tells you where you can get stills and soundtrack albums. That's all for now. Take cover. Here comes Assault on Precinct 13. <laughs>